A vast and infinite universe has always held secrets beyond our wildest imaginations. And often, these enigmas prevent the sharing of information crucial to the advancement of science. Recently, however, the most advanced space telescopes have detected a phenomenon that defies all known logic, a cosmic mystery that has left scientists across the globe stunned. Data gathered by the James Webb Space Telescope has started to cast serious doubt on the Big Bang theory itself. The discovery is so profound that it may reshape everything we think we know about the origin, structure, and fate of the universe. What Joel Rohnt and other scientists have uncovered is nothing short of extraordinary. The shocking disappearance of over 900 trillion stars, vanished, without a trace. Since it became fully operational, the $10 billion James Webb Space Telescope has delivered results that far exceed expectations. Positioned over 1.5 million kilometers from Earth, Webb has already proven itself a worthy successor to Hubble, providing unprecedented, crystal-clear views of deep space. In July 2022, it began detecting extremely long wavelengths, radiation from galaxies so distant, their light had shifted far beyond the visible spectrum into what we call redshifted ultraviolet. This light had traveled billions of years across space, acting as a time capsule from the early universe. But what the telescope uncovered was something no one was prepared for. Entire regions of the cosmos where hundreds of trillions of stars simply disappeared. These missing stars weren't faint or hard to detect. They had once been catalogued, their light measured, their spectra analyzed. Now, they're gone. The implications are staggering. Where could 900 trillion stars go? How could they disappear without any remnants? No supernovae, no black hole radiation, no lingering infrared signature. Astronomers have scrambled to explain this unprecedented observation, but answers remain elusive. Some propose that the stars might still exist but have drastically dimmed, possibly due to an unknown type of cosmic dust or a new phase of stellar evolution that reduces their luminosity to near invisibility. Others suggest they may have collapsed directly into black holes without undergoing a supernova explosion, bypassing all known models of stellar death. But then there's a far more unsettling theory, one that sends a chill down the spine of even the most hardened cosmologists. It's possible that the universe itself is entering a phase of transformation, a grand-scale shift in its fundamental fabric. A process of disappearance we cannot halt. Nearly a century ago, scientists first proposed that the universe was expanding. The further a galaxy is from us, the faster it appears to be moving away, an observation that became the foundation of modern cosmology. But around two decades ago, a shocking discovery upended even that idea. The expansion of the universe is accelerating. This means galaxies aren't just moving away, they're doing so at an increasing rate, becoming unreachable, even at light speed. Here's the unsettling part. When we observe stars that emitted their light 100 years ago, we're seeing them as they were 100 light years away. But when we look at a galaxy whose light took 100 million years to reach us, that galaxy is now much farther than 100 million light years away due to space's continual expansion. This effect becomes especially dramatic when observing galaxies across billions of light years. The very fabric of space stretches as light travels through it elongating the wavelengths in a phenomenon we call redshift. It's not the galaxy that's moving through space, it's space itself that's expanding between us and the galaxy. The James Webb Telescope has provided us with a deeper understanding of this expansion, enabling scientists to measure redshifts with unprecedented accuracy. By comparing the intrinsic brightness of distant galaxies with their observed brightness and redshift, astronomers can reconstruct the history of the universe's expansion. What they found only deepens the mystery. The farther out we look, the more extreme the redshift becomes. Some light appears to stretch so much that its original source may no longer exist in the form we understand. This cosmic stretching reveals more than just distance, it reveals the structure of the universe itself. Around 68% of the universe consists of something known as dark energy, a mysterious force responsible for the accelerating expansion. Another 27% is dark matter, invisible yet detectable by its gravitational influence. Ordinary matter, 
The stuff that makes up stars, planets, and people, accounts for only about 5% of the universe. The rest is unknown, a cosmic puzzle that Webb may help us piece together. The disappearance of these 900 trillion stars could be linked to dark energy's growing influence. At a certain critical distance, the expansion of the universe becomes so extreme that light emitted today from those galaxies will never reach us, not now, not ever. Even if we could travel at the speed of light, those regions of the cosmos would be forever inaccessible. As the expansion continues, galaxies that are not gravitationally bound to our local group will slip beyond the cosmic horizon, vanishing from our observable universe forever. It's as if we're living on an island of light surrounded by a growing ocean of darkness. The observable universe is estimated to be around 93 billion light years across, yet only about 6% of its galaxies are still accessible to us. The other 94% are already too far gone, lost to the relentless pull of accelerated expansion. Every passing second sees between 20,000 and 60,000 stars move from reachable to unreachable. The light they emitted a second ago is still on its way to us, but any light emitted from this moment forward never will. It's a sobering thought, a reminder that the universe isn't just expanding, it's drifting away from us, slowly isolating us in an ever-shrinking sphere of influence. From a philosophical standpoint, this realization forces humanity to reconsider its place in the cosmos. We are not at the center of the universe, and we are not timeless. We are living during a fleeting window of opportunity where deep space exploration is even possible. If our civilization ever hopes to venture beyond the Milky Way and its neighboring galaxies, such as Andromeda and a few dozen satellite galaxies, we must act before the universe slips too far beyond our reach. This raises questions that stretch far beyond astronomy. What if the disappearing stars are the result of cosmic evolution beyond our understanding? What if a phase transition in the universe's makeup is underway, rewriting the rules of time and space in real time? Or could the phenomenon be the result of highly advanced civilizations manipulating energy on a scale we can barely imagine, cloaking entire regions of the universe from our view? While these ideas remain speculative, they're no longer relegated to science fiction. With every revelation from James Webb, the lines between possibility and reality blur. And so, we are left with both awe and urgency. The mystery of the vanished stars may remain unanswered for years to come, but the warning it offers is clear. Our universe is in motion, not just outward, but forward through time, toward a destiny we cannot escape. The fabric of reality is expanding faster than our ability to observe or interact with it. While this may feel disheartening, it also reaffirms the value of the present moment. The stars we see today may be the last we'll ever see from those corners of the universe. If we wish to understand the cosmos, not just as passive observers but as participants in its great unfolding, we must continue to push forward. We must invest in science, in exploration, in curiosity. Because with every second that passes, the universe grows darker, quieter, and more distant. But in the light of discovery, we find purpose. And perhaps, in understanding the stars that vanish, we may yet uncover the future of our own place among them.